to me. What's up, man? I'm right here. I'm right here. I'm right fucking here, pussy. Oh, that's it. A little bitch baby ass laser. Pew pew, motherfucker. Oh, really? This motherfucker want to test me. Oh, really? You want to test me? Oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, too much. Hold up, hold up, hold up, cause I'm going in. You know, you know what it is. I be on my level. I be on my level. Can't touch me now. I be on my level. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, my fellow Echoes. Hold on, hold on. Listen to me, listen to me. Uh, before we get to the video, I'm going to go ahead and explain why Rift Maker, why I think Rift Maker is just the best item for us right now in Season 11. Because you already know, we're going to be fucking struggling now here. All right, we're going to have a look at the first two items that we have, which are Night Harvester and Hextech Rocket Belt. Now, let's have a look at Night Harvester. We get 80 ability power, 250 health, and 15 ability hest. Now, what does Soul Ren do? Damage your champion deals an additional 125 to 200 with scaling of 15% magic damage it grants you 25 percent move speed for 1.5 seconds 60 seconds per fucking champion which is good you know that means no matter what the fuck you do if you keep beating motherfuckers asses then you're just gonna keep running around like a like a you know, crack kid like a kid on crack whatever the fuck yeah. we, we out here you know pretty good item pretty good item now we go our formerly our former thing which was proto belt now rocket belt whatever so we're gonna go have a look at Rocket Belt. 80 ability power, 250 health, 15 ability hits. Now, active supersonic, dash to target location, ascending our arc of magic missiles that deal 20 to 30 damage and 15 scaling off magic damage, and then 75% move speed, moving towards enemies for two seconds, three seconds. You know, pretty good. Those two items are really good for you know, mobility and all that shit. But when it comes to, you know, dueling, and staying into the fight and you know getting all the damage done afk warning suck my d not that bad pretty fucking decent okay and now we go into my boy my big boy rift maker now why do i think rift maker is just ultimately superior to the other two because the other two are more good when it comes to mobility and when it comes to move speed you know yada yada and they do have the 15 percent scaling with the uh, with the uh, you know the active like with damaging champions deals 15 scaling magic damage and rocket bell does 15 scaling mat uh also does 15 scaling magic damage you know it's okay it's whatever okay I, I think it's okay it's not bad none of these items are bad none of these two are bad now we're gonna talk about why i think rift maker is just ultimately our, our go-to item these 11 why now look the stats are a little bit lower as in we lose 100 hp which means we're ultimately a little bit squishier which you know makes sense we're echo we're gonna be squishy either fucking way that's just how we work now if we look here we have 80 ability power 150 health, 15 ability haste. You know, 100 less HP doesn't look that attractive until you look at 15% Omni Vamp, which means more additional healing to our Ravidus Hunter, which is shit. It's a lot of motherfucking healing. Shit. It's a good amount of fucking healing. So I think it's pretty good because we get additional healing, which could actually help mid echo a, lit, a little bit because we can start being like a fucking <laughs> a fucking pseudo mini vladimir up in this bitch because we already got we already got ravenous hunter but we're, we are gonna have to get stacks for it but we do have this 15 percent omni vent which is pretty good but that's not my only selling point for this item void corruption why do i think this is so good why do i think it's so good void corruption for each second in champion combat deal three percent shut the fuck up wait you've been disconnected due to inactivity i'll be right back Okay, and we're back. Finally got back into the game. Now, Void Corruption. For each second in champion combat, deal 3% bonus damage. Max 15. At maximum strength, the bonus damage is dealt as true damage instead. Right? So, if we do ourselves some math here. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. So, 5 seconds in combat, all of our damage, uh, all the bonus damage is converted into true damage instead. And that includes... 5% magic penetration. Now, here's now here, here here's the kicker. Here's the kicker. On terms of damage scaling, it somewhat has it somewhat has Hextech Rocket Bell and Night Harvester beat beat in terms of in damage scaling because all the damage scaling is it, for Rocket Bell. It's only on the active, which is fine, and it gives 75% move speed towards enemy champions for two seconds. So it's very good for clearing the gap, which is good. I mean, I, I, it's it's good. I think it's more based on taste and preference so it's like what the hell ever but i do think that rift maker is just ultimately superior but hey don't just take my word for it i'm gonna give my personal experiences uh with the items in this video so go ahead and we're back to the video 
I'm gonna take red side scuttle as soon as it comes up. And then I might gank team up. I don't give a goddamn. We're popping off. I don't care. I do not give a fuck. I'm tired of the bullshit. Let's go. I'm going up here to gank. I don't give a fuck. Don't give a fuck. I like it, cut G. Oh, oh, no, no, no. You eat all my beans, nigga! No way he escapes. Got him. But there's no way he escapes. And as I grab this, I'm able to fuck with anybody on the rift. Wait a minute. Gotcha, bitch. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Bitch. But, eat my true damage. Fuck your shield and shit. Got him. Remember when I said I don't give a fuck? I wasn't, I wasn't fucking kidding. I don't give a fuck! I don't give a fuck! Bitch, get the fuck out of my face! That's me. What's up, man? I'm right here! I'm right here! I'm right fucking here, pussy! Oh, that's it? A little bitch baby ass laser? Pew pew? Motherfucker? Oh, really? This motherfucker wanna test me. Oh, really? You wanna test me? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Alright, too much. I think I get it. What the hell do I look like? Come on, bitch. Oh, Caitlyn! Caitlyn! Shut the fuck up! Shut your fucking mouth! <laughs> You think I give a fuck about you, Victor? You think I give a fuck? You think I give a fuck? Oh, I'm dead. Fuck you, huh? You want some too, bitch? You want some too? Oh, you really want to fucking try me? Okay, I see. Oh no, Timo! Oh, Timo! Oh god, I'm fucking scared. Shut the fuck up. Who wants some? You want it? You want some? Who wants some? You want some? You want some? You want some pussy? Huh? Oh, really, Timo? Really, Timo? Come here! Oh, fuck. I'm doing too much. Oh, fuck. Oh, 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 oh God.
Get fucked. Get fucked. Get fucked. Dude, runs, he runs into my clone, and then he's surprised that I kill him. And I have full, full build. You're saying I'm playing Echo when you see my ult clone and stay near it. You, des you deserve to lose, dumbass. Yeah, absolutely fucked, kid. Don't don't come at me. Like, Echo's ult? No, you're stupid. You literally see my ult clone, and you're surprised when a full, a full entire build Echo beats your fucking ass. Get absolutely dominated. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell for all future content. Yeah, cue up my theme music.